The hackers who came to the defense of Julian Assange may need a pretty good defense team of their own. Five members of a group of cyber hackers known as Anonymous is arrested in the UK, suspected of having a role in a series of internet attacks aimed at big business called Operation Payback. The Wall Street Journal has more of those attacks. These arrests are, um, are related to uh, what are called uh, denial of service attacks. So that's when a computer floods a server to prevent it displaying a web page. The Guardian reports Anonymous is calling the arrests a sad mistake and says it is not to be taken lightly. Hardly a veiled threat. A statement purporting to be from Anonymous released last night warned the government that it was making a sad mistake in arresting the five men and that the group considered it a serious declaration of war. The suspects are accused of violating the Computer Misuse Act, punishable by up to 10 years in prison. PC Mag notes Anonymous finds the law ridiculous. Arresting somebody for taking part in a DDoS attack is exactly like arresting somebody for attending a peaceful demonstration in their hometown. But ZDNet interviews computer law expert William Malcolm, who says this is exactly the kind of cyber meddling the law has set out to stop. The Computer Misuse Act was effectively amended to take in denial of service attacks by amendments to the Police and Justice Bill 2006. And while the group may be outraged by the police, Gawker points out it didn't take much grunt work to figure these guys out. Imagine a gang of diamond thieves plastering the internet with slick advertisements for a new heist, inviting anyone to participate, no questions asked. If there's ever another Operation Payback, Anonymous might need to figure out how to be a bit more anonymous. So what do you think? Should Anonymous be punished, or was it just a small act of protest? For Newsy.com, I'm Anna Campaign romero Multiple sources, the real story.